technologies significantly affect human life for a long time. The human use of technology began with the conversion of natural resources into simple tools, such as energy, communication, transportation, including the construction technology developed to respond to basic human needs. Through the development of this new innovation, such as the construction material or construction process, which even affected the composition of the building, such as foundation, column, beam, floor, etc. Post-tension floor system is one of innovative elements of the building to respond to a maximum of requirements. Post-tension floor system is a technological evolution of modern construction. It has been widely recognized for over 40 years in various countries around the world due to the benefits worth it. For more distances between the columns are less number of column and the wider area. Moreover, these will be able to reduce restrictions on the design and allow designers more freedom in design. The convenience and speed of the system as it can be piping without blocking. Also, allow the installation of formwork to be more convenient and economical. Can minimize the limitation on the design and provide flexibility on partition wall and also can reduce the height of the building. Moreover, the construction cost saving more than the reinforced concrete floor system 10%, including faster construction time, allowing building to be completed in a short time. As following example, an apartment 8 floor height, 8,000 square meters of living space, and approximately 250 room construction costs $4 million. The period of reinforced concrete floor system is 12 months but if constructed by post-tension system will take about eight months. The building owner will be able to decrease the loan interest approximately $100,000 and also enable to open the building faster, which accounted about $200,000. In conclusion, total revenue benefits that building owner will earn is approximately $300,000 or 7.5% of the construction value. Furthermore, post-tension can withstand vibration from earthquakes more than normal floor systems because post-tension floor systems will produce the diagram plates in the horizontal which help spread the external forces that come from the earthquake to spread across the floor plate of the building. Post-tension floor system can be divided into three models to suit the purpose at the span between the columns, which are Flat slab model is suitable for 6 to 9 meters range column Flat slab with drop panel model is suitable for 9 to 12 meters range column Flat slab with band beam model is suitable for excess 12 meters range column. The pre-stressed concrete concept is the additional pressure we put into the concrete to enhance the ability of the tensile strength of concrete to increase more force ability and reduce the floor deflection while the floor is in service stage due to concept balancing load design. The post-tension is divided into two systems as follows. 1. Unbonded system is not bonding between the PC strand and concrete, but it uses the anchorage at the both ends side of the floor to transfer the load to concrete. This system mostly used for parking lot buildings and small buildings with no change of use. 2. Bonded system is bonding between PC strand and concrete by covered PC strand with ripple galvanized duct to help in the bonding strength. Subsequently, after stressing, it is required to inject the cement paste into galvanized duct 
to grip between PC strand and steel pipe and concrete floor. This system can be used in several types of buildings and is widely used around the world recently. Seapost also uses this system. Materials and equipment used to install post tension are as follows. Concrete 320KSC cylinder at 28 day. PC strand as ASTM A416-96 standard. Type 7 wire strand, low relaxation. Anchorage type Ancora 2BS13, 3BS13 and 5BS13. Able to force up as ACI 318-95 and BS4447 standard. Ripple galvanized duct. Cement grout. These are the materials and equipment that the C Post developed its own proprietary coordinated designs together with Professor Dr. Bijan O. Alami, the one who programmed ADAPT. And this will show the processes and stages of post-tension floor construction, which can be divided into 17 steps as follows. Step 1. Formwork Setup Step 2. Fixing Slab Edge Formwork Step 3. Placing of bottom reinforcement. Step 4. Fixing anchorage bursting reinforcement. Step 5. Placing post tension tendon. Step 6. Fixing of bar chair for post-tension tendon. Step 7. Placing anchorage, pocket former, and grout vent. Step 8. Placing of top reinforcement. Step 9. Concreting of slab. Step 10. Remove slab edge form work. Step 11. Remove pocket former. Step 12. Placing anchor head and wedge in position. Step 13. Stressing. Step 14, cutting end of strand. Step 15, capping stressing recess with cement mortar. Step 16, grouting. Step 17. Remove formwork and shoring 50%. Repeat first step for construction of the next floor. All of these are the benefits of post-tension system and the sequence of steps in the post-tension construction which is an international standard accepted and widely used around the world.
are strongly confident in the potentiality and ready to create every masterpiece project for you.